Hello, first grade. This is Miss Blanchard. Today, our lesson is going to be how we figure out a number that is 10 more or 10 less than a number that I give you. First, we're going to take a look at the number 34, which is one, two, three tens, and one, two, three, four ones. Now, when we're looking at 10 more or 10 less, the ones place is always going to stay the same. The only thing we will change is the tens place. So if I wanna know 10 more than 34, I'm gonna look at my tens place and I know that more means my number's going to get bigger. So I'm going to add another 10. So 10 more than 34 would make 44. Now let's take a look again at the number 34. If I would like to look at 10 less than 34, then I would take one of my 10s away, which would give me 24. Let's try with a different number. First, I'm going to look and I have two ones. And we know we're gonna leave that the same because we're talking about 10 more or 10 less. And then I have one, two, three, four, five tens, which makes the number 52. Now I want you to stop and think. If I'm going to have 10 more and I'm going to add to the tens place, what will my new number be? I'll be adding another 10, which will change my number to 62. So I will see that 10 more than 52, 10 more than 52 is 62. We're only changing the column tens. Now if I wanted to have 10 less than 52, let's go back to 52 and see what we get. So I'm going to take away one of my tens for my number to get smaller. So now instead of 52, I will have 42. The ones place stayed the same. I only changed my tens place to have 10 more or 10 less. You can also do a trick on your 120s chart to help you figure out a number that I give you what, what is 10 more or 10 less. So if I give you the number 45, I can do two things. I can count backwards by 10 because I know less means my number is getting smaller. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten less than 45 is 35. And if you look at the pattern, instead of counting back 10 spaces, you can slide your finger up. And that number is smaller and it is 10 less. If you look in the tens place, it went from four tens to three tens. And you can do the same thing with counting up or adding one more 10. You can start at 45. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten 10. 10 more than 45 is 55. What I'm gonna ask you friends to do at home is take this worksheet and you're gonna start with the top. How much is 10 more than 79? So the first thing I need to be able to do is find the number 79 on my chart. Now I can count backwards by 10 or I can jump backwards by one row to find 10 less. So let's see, 79, there's one, two, I'm going backwards, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and that gives us 69. Let's just double check. If I start at 79 and jump backwards, it's going to give me 69. If I want 10 more, I can count 10 more forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, which would give me 89. Or I can just jump forward on my chart up a whole row of 10 to get to 89. Because if we count by tens, we see the row goes 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Always, always the tens place gets bigger when we're working with 10 more and the ones place will stay the same.